Welcome back for some more Deep Rock Galactic Survivor, and we're going to do a Cryo Cannon run. Now, I wasn't sure what class I wanted to do it on. I've decided to do it on this. Heavy Gunner because I don't want to necessarily run the CRISPR. Just because they kind of match in um, in length for their beam, right? I don't want it to feel like I need to go into the CRISPR. I'm going to take one more beam weapon to unlock beam uh beam range because that would be fun the idea though is we, we're gonna lean in heavily we've done lots of videos like this where we've gone on one weapon and just really really ram rammed all the upgrades we can into it to see what we can do with it let's see if we can make this weapon work i think it's gonna be very it's very similar in the way that the crisper works a pickup radius I think I'd rather, than the CRISPR, I'd rather just take the um, the sludge pump to get some, some beams. Oh, of course it wants me to go back the other way. Yeah, I really was on the fence about what way I wanted to go with the run. CRISPR would have been fun, but I've done, I've done CRISPR runs. There it is there. Now, it, it we have we have a CRISPR. <laughs> We're looking for the cryo cannon. I'm not gonna get it, am I? I got it. There we go. Oh, you know what you do is we take the arms coil. That'll give us beams. <laughs> That'll give us beam range. No damage. Let's have a look at the stats on this thing. Oh wow, that does not hit hard to begin with, to start with, but I think this damage will scale nicely. Maybe we can get another ice weapon. Reload heavies. I think it's it's probably I, I'm gonna say that it's probably better than the CRISPR. Um I like the the fact that it's gonna we're gonna freeze guys, right? Reload oh, speed. I like that. If we get lots of beams on this, it could be good. I'm gonna drop this early. Hazard 4 might be a trick to pull off. Especially on the hollow bow, but I like to I like to have a bit of a challenge in my runs. I also do like posting wins occasionally. Um, we are going to take the nitrogen powders. Give us some crits. Move speed. Oh well, that's that's too bad. We'll take the reloads. Now it's gonna feel like the the auto cannons carrying, right? And and it might. We I don't know. We'll see. I just felt like I felt like the CRISPR was gonna feel like it was it was just doing the exact same, right? We'll see what we can get here. I don't want anything to steal the steal the show from this, but it might just end up happening. We've had that happen once or twice in these types of videos. Oh my goodness, we got some luck. Look at that. That's that is awesome. You get a free beam like that. I was not expecting it. That's get, that is going to be huge. We're going to take the pickup radius. But if you can get the reload rate going fast, right? And we can get duration going, maybe. Um, we'll be able to really, really just have that beam running nonstop. Ooh, that's tough, but we're taking the reload. More beams. Four beams on this thing. Yeah, like this is gonna be so nice. Bro, that guy can barely he he, he can't even move. He's he's got nothing. Okay, we would like a beam weapon. Right? None of this is really working for us. Sludge pump, I was kinda thinking coil gun, but I'll take the sludge. 
I'm gonna try and I'm gonna try and breed on this. Oh my goodness. We take beam damage or beam range. I'm t I I'm so tempted to take this. But the damage. I better take this. Normally I wouldn't have taken the I, I, I normally I, I probably would have taken range. I, I really like the range. Um, we're gonna go reload beam speed. I don't know. Now that I think about it, I don't know what I should have taken there. Damage is always nice, I guess. Range is just sexy, right? Okay, now we have beam damage. We're gonna take that. We need to roll. Bingo! What else we got? Oh, you suck. We're not doing that though. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not going. We're not. We're not going for a crazy beam run. I've done. I've done runs where I loaded up on all the beams. So I'm not gonna do that. I know that sounds bad, and people might not like it, but I'm not. That's not the point of the run. The point of the run is to lean in on this one weapon. We have quotas to fulfill. What are our stats right now? Oh, we got the damage up to 55. We need that reload time a little bit better. We're going to end up with a lot of beams on this, though. Seven beams by the end, probably. So that's going to be cool. Look at already. Nice. I'll take the XP game. I still have a couple other weapons that I need to do runs for, like this. Um, the grenades, the uh, what are the dead, the heavy explosive grenades? I need to do a video for those just to see if I can make them work. I'm not sure if I can on on Hazard Four even. I think that's going to be a really tough run. Oh boy. Yeah, I think I really, really prefer this weapon over over the CRISPR. 100%. That that area, like crowd control, that's that's top notch. Exemplary work. You've achieved your objectives in a wreck of time. Nice. Need to get some mining speed. Well, these guys are all gonna die. That was a big one. Beam reload. I really don't want this thing to get overclocked, but if it happens, it happens. Um, beam damage or luck? Ooh. Luck. We've already had incredible luck in the shops and everything, right? If this wasn't a specific type of run, we'd already have two bonus beams. I want all these loot bugs. explosions from um, from the bugs would blow up the loot bugs. I think that would be nice. You know, maybe not 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 all explosions, but just an explosion from a bug. Um, can I get an icy weapon? You got anything else in here that's icy? Just offering me this stuff over and over again. I really don't want to do this. I'll roll one more time, but we're probably just going to have, have to take something. Um, Let's go with... It doesn't matter. I'm going to take... I've done this many times in this. I've been doing recently. We'll take the burst. We'll take the BRT. 
mix it up a little bit. Well, that's not what I want. We have a magnet. Can we grab that before we leave? Nothing over here. I'm still having so much fun with this game. It's kind of crazy that I'm still having a good time with this game, but I am. That's how good to me this game is. It's just got so much combinations already built into it, right? Cooked into the way the game is made. And I'm still coming up with videos and ideas for things that I haven't even tried. I've only ever used this weapon as a secondary weapon. We're taking beam damage. Yes. What's our crit chance at? 71 because of the, the nitrogenic powders? You take the mining speed, and take the mining speed. I could freeze any time now. We're getting there. Lots of damage. We'll check the damage numbers on the next floor, see where we're at. kind of a steady stream of damage on this guy. Lifetime. Move speed. This is going way better than expected, but it is, that was only area two, right? Things could get a little bit dicey here eventually. Let's see. Farm a little experience. No, no, no. Uh, I'll take the crit damage. Yeah, good crit chance. Stage completed. Onwards to stage three. And no. I'm gonna take the luck. Beam lifetime, yes. How about some beam range? Um, cold it burns. Ooh, that could be interesting. Or increase the lifetime. I mean, this would make it so we're damaging more, right? I can increase lifetime other ways. Let's do that. Oh, no. No, I don't have the gold. Okay. That's a bummer. We've got work to do and quotas to meet. You have your objectives. This friggin' hell. I don't play this map often, so I guess that's why I haven't done the um, 500 gold challenge. 550. It used to be 600. I'm not trying to do it here, but if I if I get it, I get it. It'd be cool if I did. I think I think you might need a gold scanner. I'm not 100% sure though. Now that they've they've reduced the amount, you might not need a gold scanner. The scanner just lit up like a Christmas tree. We got a swarm incoming. Um, we'll take the move speed. Yes. We can't send in supplies until you clear out the landing zone. You just need six of these. Come on. Exemplary work. You achieved your objective in a record time. We haven't had any um for this weapon, we haven't had any 
paint jobs yet, really. So it's just kind of moving along slowly. I love the the area control on more lifetime. Like we're just we're just locking everything down. XP um I'll take this. Armor. When we lose some uh lose some health. Reload. Right now, even for a even for a run that is not optimized at all, right? This feels pretty decent. XP gain. Um, we we'll go reload speed. That's gonna help us get all of our, our beam up again. I'd love to. I'd love to make a run work where I just go lots of gold, like a beam run, where I go for as much gold as possible, and I try to um, roll in the shops for uh, beam range. It would be fun to just go for as much beam range as possible. I've I've attempted it. That's one I have attempted, and I've had terrible luck. Our damage? I didn't look at the stats, did I? 106. 19, 19 and a half seconds up. And it's only down for 1.6. So it's basically just up continuously at this point. That is effect damage. Yes. I rarely pick one of these. Beam damage. Yeah, like this right now feels way better than my CRISPR run. I don't feel like I'm in danger really at all. Anything down here for us to grab before I'm out of here? Get some gold down here maybe? He's going to die. I'd left a big chunk of the map unexplored. About to pop. There he goes. Go reload heavies. Um, oh. Uh, this map sucks. Why I don't one of the reasons I don't do a lot of videos on this on this map is you can get screwed by the by the actual terrain so much. In my opinion, still by far the hardest map. That's one for the books. Taking you to stage four minor. Okay. Um we have some gold. We'll take beam lifetime again. I'm not gonna go reload on everything. We're gonna roll. Try again. Ooh. We'll take that. Take all of this. That's going to get us all the way up. Three more beams. We get some, uh, get some range, maybe. I'm tempted to hold on to my gold now. I think I'm going to. I think I'm going to hold on to my gold until the final shop. See, see what we do. Look at that. This thing is gonna absolutely destroy. Alright, I'm a fan. I, I wasn't sure, but I, I definitely like this weapon. And we haven't even increased the range at all. If we could get that range even 50%. It'd be nuts. If you're still here at this point in the video, thank you so much for watching. If you haven't liked the video, it helps a ton with the algorithm. We're going to get a win here, guys. This feels like an easy win. Here's some range. Yes, please. 
Finally. I wouldn't mind if they added things like that. Like class specific type weapons. I wouldn't mind if they added that into the meta progress. Give me some more beam range, man. Can't go that way. That's way too dangerous. Way too dangerous. Yeah, we're up to seven frosty beams. So everything's just getting frozen. These big guys drop a lot of experience. I don't think I'm going to hit that 550 gold. See, I wasn't, I wasn't like forcing it, but it would have been cool if we did it. I put myself in a really bad spot. Go armor. Timely little bit of armor. Um, up in a very bad spot. Whoa, did I just like bully my way through that? I think I did. I don't know how I even... I don't know how I managed to get through that by only getting hit once. Again, bad spot. Ow. Beam range. Now we've got it going. 20%. Like, it, or with 20% even, it seems way more noticeable. Ooh. Um, this can stack really nicely. I'm going to take that. We might not stop a ton, but when we do, we're going to get those nice little, nice little bumps in uh, reload speed. We're already here. That's inconvenient. We don't want to take too long on this area for killing this dude, because, I mean, like, the swarm's going to get out of hand real fast. We took that little bit of mining speed when we did. Our damage is really, really good. We're gonna easily beat this. I wonder if we'll be able to how easily we'll be able to take out the the dreadnought though. Hell yeah. That's a big kaboom. Going for it. I want that experience, man. Uh beam range. Like, look at that. Just 30% on the range. Crazy. Any gold over here? Yes. We're going to be very close to hitting that 400 or 550, I think. We've got to be up over 400 at this point. Okay, no, he's dead. Yeah, this might be a Hazard 5 weapon after all. I didn't think it was, but... I think this might be able to carry you through a Hazard 5 run. We don't even have um, anything to... Like, we haven't put anything else on that's icy. Let's go... I better take damage. At this stage of the game, I better just do it. Play it safe. Oh boy. There we go. No way. A legend. Let's shake it up. Beam range. This works. All right, that's kind of sick. Nothing for me here. Let's try again. Um, we could take beam lifetime. Another 20% to lifetime would be pretty cool. Or we can roll for more beam range. 
I'm gonna take the lifetime. There's more lifetime. Was that not lifetime that I just took that was 20%? Lifetime as well. Um. Oh, sure. It'll do. Nothing for me here. Let's try again. That's it. All right. Off we go. Only one way to rouse okay, let's have a quick look at the stats on this thing. Reload time is a second. Uptime on it is 28 and a half. So, I mean, that's amazing. Damage 146. We got seven total beams. The range. I don't know if that weapon range for heavy. I guess it maybe does. Maybe it's an extra 25%. I guess it is, eh? So then we also have another 45% beam range. That's that's really good. This thing we're gonna destroy, I think. We have less than a hundred gold to collect. And we do that. That looks so cool. Like we're gonna destroy this. We're gonna kill these dudes. I wanna I wanna try and get that 550 gold now. We can. I think we're gonna fall just short though, with no scanners. A lot of weapons can't compete on Hazard 5 like this. This one is surprisingly powerful. Mind you, we haven't killed the Dreadnought yet, so we'll see how that goes. Right, we, aren't, we aren't at the end yet. We haven't won yet. Talking like we've already won. Let's pop these guys. Get them out here. Bring it out. More loot bugs. Uh, pick up radius. We haven't had to overclock anything, right? Nothing's nothing else is overclocked. This is gonna be super dangerous. Yeah, we're not going down there. Bolt tip bullets might be nice right now. Pickled nitro would be a death sentence, so you don't have to worry about me taking that. I don't think. At 96 nitra in our pocket, we, I don't think we'd be able to move. And I am an enthusiast of the pickled nitro. I think even I have my limits to how much nitro I'm willing to carry in my pockets and take it. Because you will die. I'm fine with it taking this one guy out. Yeah, there you are. I'm not taking it. I think that's too much. I think that's too much nitro. I would, I would lose... I would be so far in the whole movement speed, I wouldn't be able to move. We'll take the dodge. I'm not a fan, but it is what it is. It, it pains me to pass up my, my favorite, uh, my favorite artifact. But if I took it, it was going to cost me the run. Probably. Because I don't think with this weapon, I don't think of this weapon getting um, all the damage. We would have gotten a huge amount of damage, almost 200% increase in damage, right? I still don't think that would have been enough to wipe out the boss. Now, maybe because he wouldn't be able to move much. But it would have been, it would have been close. We just bring him out. Oh, we still have one more guy. How close are we on this gold? Oh, man. If I could just find, like, one more patch of gold anywhere, but I don't think there is any. We'd have it. He's going to come, and I'm in a bad spot. I don't like where, I, where I'm at. Take a little path here. There, take some mining speed. Or else he's going to be, uh, he's going to eat me.
So can we freeze him in place and really screw up his jumping patterns? That's going to be important for us if we're going to survive this. Because I don't know about the overall damage that we're going to do. This is an okay spot. I'm okay with being in here. I can get him, bait him to jump. That. We need more range. Maybe. Looking dangerous right now, isn't it? He's not even half dead. Maybe I should have taken the Nitra. I just got steady damage on him. It's not enough. It's not cutting. Halfway dead. Almost half. Beam range? Yeah. That's huge. Being able to keep the beams on him longer is good. The bugs are growing stronger. Not that strong. Not that many bugs. Better mine some of this out, though. Eh. It is getting a little bit too much, eh? I don't have anything that's going to give me a damage boost either. I don't have, like, mocap. Yep, I think we're going to die. He just dove across. That's actually bad for me, maybe. In a way. I can get him to dive the other... Dive across this. Maybe we'll be okay. Yeah, like, into that. Crush all that. I need this open. Come on. There you go, big guy. There you go. Man, the crowd control on this weapon is nuts. Like, it's just crazy. Okay, he's getting a little bit... He's getting a little bit aggressive here. I don't like that. I don't like how, how mean he's getting. Getting really mean. Go that way. There you go. Wait, wait, did he just walk through there? He did. Guess what's on the menu? More bugs. More bugs. This might be the most incredible crowd control weapon in the entire game. That is insane. I had no business surviving that. None. Wow. That was nuts. I had no no business. Pick up radius. Give me that. Yeah, we had no business winning that. That was really cool. Um, we didn't hit. We did not hit the gold. We were short. But one scanner and you have it, right? Pretty easily. And... You know, not not crazy uh, overall damage, but I mean, you add in that cold damage there, and that's pretty good, right? Basically, double damage with the cold. So, you're doing you're doing probably around twenty thousand when you add that on there. Guys, thank you so much for watching. If you want to see more Deep Rock Galactic Survivor, make sure to subscribe to the channel. I'll catch you on the next one. Have a fantastic day.